Hi guys, welcome back to the house with all the kids. Um, I know it's been a while since uh, we've posted a video. Um, as most of you know, if you watched our last video, um, about three and a half weeks ago, we uh, did lose our 22 year old son to a car accident. So the last several weeks have been a little rough around here. But um, we're getting used to our new normal, trying to, and uh, the kids really wanted to uh, get back into vlogging. Uh, so today we have decided we're going to talk about feelings, especially our younger children's feelings and how we help them to manage them. The house with all the kids, not all through blood, but all through love. The house with all the kids, sharing good times and bad times and always being there for each other. We are grateful and blessed each day. each day Most amazing family with 19 kids Welcome to the channel We are the house with all the kids Okay, so I've made this uh, little spot in our closet. We have a fairly big closet. So in the corner of the closet I have made uh, this little spot that we call we either call it like the calm down corner or the self-regulating corner, but it's just a quiet place where uh, they can come and um, get comfy, lay down, and they can do numerous things that I'll show you to help them manage their feelings. So um, might be a little dark in here, sorry, but well, here's their, their little spot here, pillow and then just kind of a pad. And um, over here we have this box of pans, pencil, and in here there's just like some different gadgets that, you know, if they're really frustrated, they can, you know, play with these things. This is a, you know, a little snake thing, I guess. And uh, here, this little toy here has just got a little ball in it that they can just move around in there. It's good for like sensory stuff, this little ball thing just a bunch of different little gadgets that just kind of help them to get out some frustration if they want to. A little water game. You know, so they're, this thing, I think this thing's pretty cool. It's very soothing. If you can see that good against the pillow. It's like oil water deal. But I could stare at that forever. This really works good for Noah. He's my more emotional, sensitive guy. And this, he really likes this. And then just like a bunch of little like uh, games. And then uh, there's some CDs in here where they can um, listen to some music if they want to. And uh, this little book here, they can, you know, Draw pictures. Obviously, someone was angry here. And yeah, I don't draw all of them, but where they can write in there what upset them and how they feel, and a picture of that. And then just a coloring book. And then over here um, is books about different emotions. The uh, Holy Week, this is a good one. This talks about different feelings that you might have, but also. Uh, brings Jesus how he felt this way at different times in his life and how he, sorry I probably wasn't on that very good, and how he dealt with it. So that really is helpful for the kids. It's a good book. I, I'll link it below for you guys if you're interested. And here's this little book of stickers so they can play with that. And then just more books. Being Selfish, Wonderful You, Cool Down, Work Together, Work Through Anger, when I feel angry, when I feel sad, when I feel worried. And then this is a whole little set of uh, God I need to talk with you about. And they're just stealing, cheating, healthy eating, vandalism, just a ton of, a lot of them that don't really relate to my kids right now, but some of them hopefully never. But bad manners, talking back, paying attention, bad temper, lying, sharing. Bad words, read, feeling sad, laziness, bullying, video games, disrespect, anything like that that they might be feeling or 
want to read about, they can do that. Then I also have this lotion in here. Noah really likes this. Stress relief. It's a eucalyptus spearmint. He'll like rub it on his arms and his hands and smell it, and it helps to calm him down. I think. So is what they do is usually if somebody's upset or sad. Let me see if I can brighten this up a little. Um, it's kind of dark in here. They'll come in here and uh, this little work sheet here. Like the last person that was in here, they felt that anxious. So here's all the different ways they can feel. And so they will put anxious up here that somebody did. And over here, how what I want I want to and to help fix themselves or help themselves through it. Talk to someone and listen to music is what that last person that was in here chose. So they can do that, and then over here is just a chart and to help them understand what they're feeling. And if they don't really know what those feelings are, here's this little uh, thing that tells you what each feeling is. It calms, feeling relaxed, still, and quiet, if you can read that or not. And the emotional face to it. Angry, feeling intense rage, aggression, or fury. So they can go through that and so that help them to kind of understand how they're feeling. Like, oh, okay, yeah, that's definitely how I'm feeling because I'm feeling pretty relaxed and still and calm right now. So I must be, or quiet, so I must be feeling calm. So a lot of times they'll come in here and they'll do all this and then sometimes I'll even come in and um, if it's something they're really struggling with, that um, I'll come in with them and sit with them and maybe read some of these books with them or just talk with them. Okay, so here's Noah and um, a lot of times when Noah's in here or any of the other kids, Noah te seems to be the one that actually uses this the most, um, but a lot of times when he's in here, um, I'll come in with him. Sometimes he'll want to talk to someone, so I'll come in here with him, right Noah? And we'll lay down here together and read a book together or we'll just talk about, you know, whatever his problem is and try to pick a, a corresponding book to what he might be feeling and go over the chart together and just talk things out. So go ahead Noah, what do you, how do you like your calm down corner? What is it that you do when you come in here? I usually get this and this. Yeah, and I knew this was your favorite one. I was just telling them about that. What does that do for you when you look at, hold it up so they can see it. What does that do for you when you look at it? It makes me feel better. Yeah, like calmer? Is watching it calms you down? Yeah. What else do you like to do in here? This. What else helps you with? Yeah. What does that do for you? I don't really know. You don't know? It <laughs> maybe just helps calm you down, helps you concentrate yeah, on it? Yeah, and this is kind of a game. I'm trying to get all of them in the gotta right... Gotta hold it up here, honey, so they can see it. I'm trying to get all of them in the right order. Like, green. Mm -hmm. Both the greens and both the reds. So it kind of gives you something to keep your mind off of whatever you're stressing about right at the moment. Okay, what else? Okay. Um, this. What do you do with that? See how I feel. Right there I feel calm. Oh, there you felt calm? <laughs> that was a calm one? Mm -hmm. This, I felt mad. Yeah. This, I felt sad. Oh, was that tears? Yeah. And then oh, frowny face. I felt sad again. No, wait, that's cool. And that's it. Okay. I didn't have a joke okay. sense. And then I also like to listen to this. The C D. Yeah, yeah which... that's one of your favorites. What's your favorite song on there? Do you remember? No. You don't remember what the name of your favorite one is? No. It doesn't really say anything. Oh. Okay. What we else? are trying to look for a DVD player. Yeah, we need to get a new DVD player, don't we? Because ours broke. And then I also use this to calm me down, which I'm almost out of. Yeah. See? Right there. Yeah, you like that stuff. It smells so good. And then I usually... Do we sometimes read these books? Yeah. Mom usually does. So what about the charts back there? Do you like using those? 
See, I'm feeling. So right now, how are you feeling? Disappointed. What? You're feeling disappointed today? Because I don't know if I'm going to go to practice or not. Oh. Well, I just got a text from Daddy, honey. And you're not going to have practice today. <sighs> you know. I'm sorry. Mm. Because we got a bunch of snow last night, which is crazy, end of April, but I guess it's not that crazy. We do live in Michigan. So yes, I do understand why you're going to be disappointed. So what do you think we should do about that? Hmm? I'm sorry. I know he had his last practice was canceled too because it was like 40 degrees. So we didn't get to go to that one either. So what do you think? We'll pick up there. What do you want to do? To help you get I want to listen to music. Okay, we'll put that up there. I we can. We can bring in the other re recorder in here until we get a new one. And then I also want to. The coach did say though on Friday they're going to try to squeeze one in if he can get a field on your on a day that you normally wouldn't have practice. So hopefully you'll be able to have one on Friday. Okay. So a lot of times we sit in here and we talk things out together, don't we, honey? So what lately have you been dealing with? Like maybe have you been thinking a lot about um, your brother passing away? Would that be something yeah. that maybe has been a struggle for you that you've been having to work through? And we've had to do a lot of talking about that, haven't we? So do you like this place? This little area here? What's your favorite part about it? That I get to choose one of my stuffs to do. Mm -hmm. And putting this on me. Do you like it that it's in a quiet spot and kind of be all Ooh. by yourself? Oops. You know, be by yourself and kind of can think about things. Yeah. Is there anything else you'd like to tell our friends about it? That how they would maybe want to do this for their younger kids? All right. First, you get what is this, Mom? Oh, a pad. So and then you rub a blanket over it. Okay. And then you get two. A pillow. I usually play on my phone in here. <laughs> yep, you have played on my phone in here before too, haven't you? That's another thing to calm me down, playing one of those uh, mind bender type games. Yeah, that's nice. It's a secret. If you have a Gario, go to settings and then go all the way to view. Then you hit play games and then there's all the games that you can play. Mm. We'll be sure to let them know that. Okay, so what else? Anything else you'd like to no. add in here? Okay, so these charts up here, um, I got them from, no wait a second, I got them off of um, another vlogger that I follow, her name is JDA, I'm not sure if she um, actually made them up or if she got them from somewhere else, but um, I will link her below and where you can get these charts, so um, that you can, I, I want to say they were free, but I'm not 100% sure. Um, but I will find that out for you so you can just laminate them and get some Velcro and um, post them up there if you want to. And then um, I can also uh, post these little trinket thing, little trinket things that we got. I'll post them below to see, see where you can get those and um, our books that we have. I'm going to be refreshing this here soon. I have some posters that um, I have on order that I'm going to be putting in here too that I can show you after we get those and um, like he said we're looking for a new CD player so he can listen to his music but all in all this is a really really great way for um, especially the younger kids to just try to work through their feelings and and you can kind of pay attention to when they are in here and if you know they're really struggling it's a perfect time for you to kind of just snuggle up with them read them a book and really just talk about things and help them work their th way through it and uh, we have really liked it over last I think two years we've had this up and um, like I said it's really been helpful the last few weeks with our tragedy that we've had so um, I hope this helps somebody else out and their little guys and girls um, so let me know in the comments if there's something that you guys do that is different that would maybe help us out and um, if you like this so uh, I will talk to you guys later thanks a lot bye